Alright, it's a boy dropping out here, and as you can see from the title, Isekai. And there's a lot of Isekai mangas, webtoons, and manhwas. But first of all, I'ma recommend you Kekon Yubiwa Monogatari, or in English, Tales of Wedding Rings. Now, the main character is Sato, if I'm correct. He gets summoned, and he has like multiple wives because he's the. The gimmick of his power in this world is that he gets stronger the closer he gets or the more in love he is with his wives. Yes, it's a harem adventure romance, romance, shonen, comedy, drama, edgy, fantasy, action. Can't leave that out. Next one on our list, something a little bit unique. Uh, Kumo Desuga Nanika, or like. In English, I think it was like, I'm a spider, so what? Okay. You'd be like, oh, a spider. A spider, so... She, yes, female, female uh, hero, heroine. She gets reincarnated, you know, she dies. She's a spider, and you'd be like, oh, a humanized form of a spider, that's hot. No. I'm 43 chapters in, and that's a big no. She's still a spider with like six legs? Or was it eight? Yeah, let's go with six. And the story is funny. It's action packed. It's fantasy. It's sane and it's supernatural. And I'm recommending it to you because it's pretty good. Next one on our list. I read this. Well, no. It's ongoing and I believe it was back in August 2019 I it first released its first chapter okay let's aim for the deepest part of the otherworldly labyrinth Kanem Kanami a young man that's our main character here you know he gets reincarnated to a weird world and he's level one no recollection of a wound and shit like that. Yeah, he's in a different world. Makes his weapon and skills. It's all that gimmick of uh, Isekai. But I love the characters though. We have Kanami, we have this mysterious girl, we have this main character, we have this other girl that helps him in his adventure. Now we have in our fourth spot. Mushoku Tensei Isekai Itala Honki Das Honki Das It's job, jobless, jobless reincarnation It will be all out if I go to another world The main character is a 34 year old Mi Otaku He fat man He ugly bastard hentai Equivalent He dies, he gets reincarnated into A family of I believe his mother great I'm not gonna say anything because I can't really remember the story. But the main character's name is Rudeus, I believe. And it's adventure. It's seinen, it's not shonen because there's like some serious things they tackle about. Well, I won't be saying anything because it's spoiler. It's a good isik. I, I would say it's the one of the best I've ever read compared to some of the isekais today and some in this list. This one would be top tier. Next one on our list, um, no de no, Nidome no Yusha. I almost butchered that, but I am. This is more of a revenge Isekai story. I mean, he gets Isekai. In, I guess in essence, reincarnate, not really fully go to another world. But he was a healer, a support of their squad. He defeated. He helped them defeat the demon lord and he gets betrayed. Surprisingly, he gets reincarnated to the time he was summoned. So yeah, he, it is an isekai, a proper one. A revenge isekai. This is also top tier. I'd say. Next one on our list, this would be, this, this would be the sixth one in our list. Berserk of Gluttony. Oh wait a minute, I don't think this is Isekai. Oh shit. Oh, hold that point. I'm a <laughs> Let me skip this this one a bit. Okay, I'm checking, I'm checking, and I've remembered one. 
I refer it to Shokugyu the Sekai Saikyu. This is an enemy. Guy gets reincarnated with his class plus teacher. He gets betrayed by some 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 dude in his class. He gets power ups. He gets a harem. It's a fantasy adventure action. All right, in their numbers in number seven, another revenge isekai. I believe I've recommended this one. Maybe or maybe not. Fukushu Okonegao Saiku Yushawa. Yushawa. Yami no Chik. Chik. <laughs> oh god, I'm, I'm gonna go to the English one. The hero who seeks revenge shall exterminate with darkness. The strongest brave who craves for revenge extinguished with the power of darkness. That's like two titles for them. So we have Roll. Roll. Yeah, defeated the Demon King and then he gets betrayed by the Empire who fucking summoned him. So he's like, you know what? I'ma team up with the goddess and I'm gonna take my revenge because not only did they betray him and kill him, they massacred his family and anyone he cared for. So revenge justified. This is one of the top tiers. If we're going with revenge isekais or just revenge in general, this is one of the top I'd say. I'd give it like a four out of five. 4.5 action. Next one. Now thinking about thinking about it, this is the one that was about healing. The other one I was talking about, but not really healing. I think it was using some bullshit skill. He just helped the team kill the demon king. This one that I'm about to recommend is the guy that was a healing mage. All right, Kaifuku Jutsushi no Yavinaoshi. I think I did recommend this one. Very familiar. Healing magicians cannot fight alone. Kere. I'm pronouncing their names in bedroom them as I go along. Honestly. He's a healing mage. He helps them. And then he noticed that. Wait a minute. The potential of healing. I, I now know. But then he gets betrayed. Dies. But before he dies, he's like. I'm going to use healing magic. And go on the world itself to go back four years you'll be like how and this way healing magic here is like you, re you get a cut or you get a wound you use healing magic the magic would just reverse technically reverse the state of your wound to the time where it wasn't it wasn't wounded you know it's like your hand is now cut reverse that reverse some time bullshit boom. it's at the state where it wasn't even cut Next on our list, 9, number 9, I believe. Isikai Tensei Sudoki, Balud Cornelius, main character's name. He, this is funny though, he has like three, two other dudes that are with inside him that have Isikai with him. So there's like three souls in one body, and it's a harem, action, adventure, comedy, drama. And yeah, it's comedy and action is on point. Number 10 in our spot. Oh my god. Um, Tondome skill de, de Isekai Horomenshi. Dude gets reincarnated, he can only cook. He's a chef. And he tames Fenrir or Fenris, depends on the context. One of the strongest monsters in the current world. And yeah, he parties with him because, you know, he feeds it. Technically tames it. Tames the beast through its stomach, as I say. Now, number 11 in our list would be the Rising of the Shield Hero. I'm not gonna say shit because everybody already knows this. It has an anime and other stuff in it. So, no. I'm also gonna, not gonna recommend, even though I should. It's not, more, it's not really manga, but it's more like animes, really. Overlord and Ray Zero, both isekai. If you like a little bit of that, um, seinen, you know, category compared to the shonen one. If you want something lighthearted, go for Konosuba. No, I'm not gonna stop there. There's still more to come. One of them is Konjiki no Moji Tsukai, or, I mean, it's <laughs> Yusha no Yonin. Makikomareta, you cheat. 
Him and his classmates get easy guide. He gets left behind. We need like get the fuck out of here. We only need like three people in this team as heroes. Or was it four? And there's like five people. He gets left out. He has unique magic. He has word magic. He can write words and enchantments. And they just do that shit. We also have the new gate. Basically, dudes, it's like you're playing Sword Art, Sword. Art. You're in the game of Sword Art Online, except you now live it. Like we're just playing one, one moment, and then the next moment, boom, you are the dude. You are you're playing. We also have Suyokute Nusaga. So the hero Kale dies, the Demon King dies, and then he, you know gets isekai back to the past to like fix everything and shit this is like fast reviews right now there's also one that I would say like can it really be isekai I'm just gonna skip it and the name is Gesell Shaft Blue I don't know that yeah I'm thinking like is that even an isekai can I even consider that we also have one of the axe mangas that I read. Axe in terms of like he got just cut in half. Man. Dungeon Seeker would be really great to see more, but they just time skipped and be like bada boom bada beam we're closing the story. Oh you think it's done fam? No, you see the timer in this one? There's like extra two to three minutes left. We have Shin oh, am I am I correct on this one? I'm checking it. Okay, never mind. We have reincarnate as a sword. Guy gets reincarnate reincarnated as a sword and he partners up with his user, which was a female protagonist. That's it. OP sword with crazy skills. Okay. We also have um am I correct? Shin Shingan no Yusha. The guy was like Well the goddess I believe or the guy hey you should like try this weapon and he's like no i'm gonna use this um, log a wooden log and i'd say it was very effective because he leveled up quick that's the gimmick in this easy guy i hope to yeah it's an easy guy i'm on central we next one in our list is magic craft meister he gets easy guy to like some place and he's alone and he can craft shit that's the game right there next one would be Manuke na FPS player ga isikai e ochita bai or bai bai I think that's a la that's how you pronounce this one it's like what if you're an FPS player and you get isikai to like uh, a fantasy RPG <coughs> MMO world where you have all your FPS skills, like you can buy guns, you could buy armor and shit, you can buy some crazy suits, futuristic ones. It's amazing. The last two would be the magic in this other world is too far behind. That's the English translation, I can't remember the Japanese one. Guy and his classmates gets reincarnated and his classmates don't know that he's actually a magician in their world that like... There's like a magic police or something, and he's like a, the investigator or something of that organization. But he gets isekai and he's here, and he's like, "Yo, the magic in this world is like trash." And follow the main character and his wa wacky adventures. Okay, last one on our list. Tense Kenjo no isekai life daini no shokyu wo ete sek. I'm not. I'm not gonna pronounce that shit. Guy gets Isekai, this is brand new. Gets, guy gets Isekai to a world where he can tame monsters. He tamed slimes, but he can like, he has like crazy abilities and magic mana pool specifically. Like he can use those abilities and his slimes could also use the, those abilities. He can create force fields and stuff. It's like, his slimes increases if, um, AOE when it comes to skill I think that's the last one I'm not gonna create the tier list but watch out for another top top video list this time we will be focusing on delinquent delinquent 
mangas yeah delinquents you know fighting and stuff like that I try to focus on manga if, if, if I can't do that it could either be webtoons or man of was well subscribe like watch my other vids especially that watch my other videos and thanks for watching